Martha Abbott has had problems with her eyesight since she was a child. Things took a turn for the worse in her teenage years when she lost it completely. She was forced to drop out of school in grade 10 with poor grades. But her fortunes turned around after a visit to one of Namibia's eye specialists landed her a job at the Nomad Wellness Day Spa. Disability, not inability. When, if you are disabled, doesn't mean that that is the end of your life. Is where life ends. The, you have also something to do, even with not your eyes. Even you cannot see, you can also do something with your hands. The day spa started operations 15 years ago and gradually transitioned into a fully integrated wellness homestead. It's run by Marianne Akwenye, who says proving disability is not inability is the inspiration behind her work. I walked into a lecture room as the group of, of trainees were being trained at the time and the lecturer simply said, close your eyes and be in tune with the body. And that sparked something in my mind to think, oh, hang on, if we have to instruct sighted women how, you know, to actually focus and be, for them to be able to focus to close their eyes and so on, what about women with visual impairment or blind women? Where are they? You know, um, so that's, it literally started like that. When it first opened, the day spa had an intake of 20 visually impaired trainees and only six of them graduated. But it hasn't deterred Akwenye, who continues to provide opportunities to train more and more visually impaired young women. Yolandi Enkart works as a trainer at the center, equipping students with vocational skills to allow them independence. A beautician by training, Enkart has been with the institution since its inception. We teach them everything about the human body. We teach them anatomy, physiology, basic business skills. And then with a the practical, yeah, you have to physically take their hands and show them how to do a massage. You can't just, for a sighted person, for example, you will just tell them this is how you do it. But for visually impaired, because they can't see you, you have to physically show them how they must do each movement on the body. Nevelin Amwenye is a regular at the establishment. She said her sister-in-law, who works in the field of women empowerment, brought her along for a girl's day out, and since then she has fallen in love with the experience. I do believe that when you look at therapy, specifically with reflexology, you're able to focus on certain um, pressure points within the body, as Sarah is doing right now with my foot where you know that certain ailments that you might actually be experiencing can somehow be not necessarily cured, but they can be, the impact in terms of pain can actually be lessened. The day spa, which is set up with a contemporary African feel, deviates from the standard that clients, especially tourists, are used to. The Nomad Wellness Homestead redefines holistic well-being and caters to the spiritual, physical, psychological, and emotional needs of its clients. And this is felt in the ambience and traditional African decor. Vitalio Angula, Africa Matters, Wintuk, Namibia. Vitalio Angula, TRT World, Wintuk, Namibia.